Hey what is up everyone, it is William here, bringing you guys another Roblox video, now today's video I'm going to show you guys the extensions that I use for my Roblox account. I basically made a video on how to trade for beginners and you guys really wanted to see the extensions I use, so here I am to bring you guys the extensions I use. Pretty much every Roblox player should be using these extensions, if you aren't using these extensions you are literally missing out, but with that said though let's go ahead and just get right into it thing that I want to talk about is do not download fake extensions okay only trust the links that I link in the description do not trust the links in the comments if anyone tries to link anything fishy if anyone tries to make you download an extension do not download it unless you know it's a hundred percent reliable there are a ton a ton of extensions out there that basically just take your Roblox account take your limiteds take your Robux everything you worked hard for and I, I actually did fall for those ones when I first started so do not fall for those fake extensions but with that said though let's go ahead and just get into the extensions I use so the first extension I use is Roblox plus remember guys leave a like on the video subscribe if you guys do out more you know this type of content but Roblox plus will be the first extension I use so when you do download it remember I will link it down below in the description when you uh, do download it you want to click it it will bring up this little thing right here you want to go to uh, the settings and then it'll bring you to your account settings uh, the Roblox plus settings now, Roblox Plus is actually a very useful extension. If you click on the little Roblox Plus thing here, right uh, under notifications, you guys can, you know, fix, um, ed make edits to this. This part doesn't really matter, to be honest. Uh, I care more about what's in the uh, Roblox Plus settings. And then if you go to your notifications, this is very important for traders because you can actually, um, you guys here, you can turn on the group shout notifications. So whenever, you know, a group shout, um, you will get notified whenever, you know, one of your groups you're in, you know, shouts out something. This is the part that all the traders want um, the trade status notification now I have my turned off but basically when you turn it on that's when like it notifies you whenever you get sent a trade so if you get sent a trade if, you, if someone accepts a trade if someone declines a trade like a little notification will pop up on the bottom right corner over here just telling you that you know you accepted a trade you declined a trade someone accepted a trade someone declined a trade counter a trade you know basically everything with trading all right and the rest of these are really self-explanatory notify when your friends come online you guys can literally just change this make your edits to it it's a very simple extension and a lot of roblox players do have it another reason why this extension is really important you guys can see here displays users wrap and header so basically what this does if you turn it on is let's say you go to some random guy's profile okay so let's go to my profile now the reason why this is so helpful for roblox traders especially is it basically shows the wrap of the player right so it shows that i have 106k wrap it doesn't show value though sadly but it also does show if you click on that all the items and how many collectibles you have so it basically gives your whole inventory your limited inventory and yeah so this is just very nice to see you know what limited your friends might have what limited other traders might have that you would want very very simple way and there's also a ton of other stuff here you guys can see here but with that said though let's get into the next one the next one over here will be called roblox stats now i've had roblox stats for a while and i believe a lot of other people have it but basically this extension is very useful for showing your sales and then also it shows another you know a few cool things too so basically you guys can see here it literally lists the sales of every single item you guys see here burger bunzy has 32,000 sales which is kind of insane because i don't know why you'd but i mean yeah oh wait that actually does look kind of funny okay yeah i see why that is so many sales but anyway it also does give you some stats on games as well which is really cool so you guys can see here let's say you go to the game pass store you guys can see the total game pass revenue is uh about 2 billion robux right now um yeah are uh, that might be trillion i'm really dumb with like numbers so it's either billion or trillion i'm not too sure and then if you actually go ahead here to the vip thing you can also see it shows you the sales as well um i believe it also does show you the date it's created the date it's updated and then obviously it shows these sales so you can see the vip game has says 471,000 sales. So that is it for that extension. And then moving on, this is probably the most important extension besides of Roblox Plus. Now this one is called BTR or BT Roblox. All right. So you want to go ahead and click that when you do download. Remember, I will link these extensions down below in the description. Only trust those links because the other links could just be trying to hack your Roblox account and take your Robux and that stuff. And I really don't want that happening to you guys. So let's go ahead here and get into BT Roblox. So BT Roblox, very, very cool thing as well. Now, this is actually the extension where it shows the Robux to, you know, like American dollars. So 
like you know you see right here right price 1000 and then it shows the uh the you know the the price in you know usd or whatever currency you guys you know use whatever canadian i, I don't i don't really know what you guys use it that it's very helpful for that um even though i don't really use that it's just kind of cool to see it also shows the fast user search so basically let's say you want to search up uh gpr3 or hot demand a a any of your favorite trading youtubers double box I, I don't know so gpr3 and then boom it would pop him up right here now if you didn't have this extension it wouldn't pop him up right here it it's it's literally just a quick search feature um but i use it a ton and it's very very helpful because you can get to their profile a lot quicker than if you just search in the search bar and stuff um yeah so it you can also hide uh sorry hide ads so if i select that you just refresh the page and then all the ads you guys can see here boom they just disappear um i don't know why i didn't have that equipped earlier i probably should have had that equipped earlier um now one really cool thing about this uh extension is you can also show the last uh online so basically what that does is it shows when the last person was online so if you want to like go to your friend's profile and you know let's say you guys haven't talked in like five years you want to see when he was last online um so for example if, if i went to like what jack all right so let's just go to jack's profile here okay jack is terminated um uh, what, what about john we can just go to john john is terminated please please don't be ter okay john is not terminated he actually wow john is premium and a million rap okay so you can see here he was last online one month ago so it basically is really good for that it basically shows all this stuff right here um, it also show, uh, sorry, shows the join date and the place visits. So I think that is a very cool feature as well. Really guys, you can just mess around here, see what features you guys want to use and what features are best. It's really, really simple. Um, another thing that the last thing I want to highlight for the video is you can actually also change the uh, theme. So if you want to change it to dark mode, you can actually do that in the settings now because Roblox added it, but back then they didn't have it. So let's say I want to change it to the sky theme or whatever. Okay. So if you refresh the page here you guys can see the background is basically just a cute little blue sky um and then yeah so that is basically the three extensions that i use and really that's really all you guys need if there are any new extensions though hunter likes i'll try to find some new extensions that are trustworthy that you guys should download if you guys want to but with that said i hope you guys did enjoy make sure you guys go ahead and leave a like on the video if you guys did like these extensions and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next one remember do not download any fake extensions use the links in my description because those are the real extension all right there are so many fake extensions out there and I just don't want you guys getting hacked or anything. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out, everyone.